Growing up, I faced adversity head on. At the age of six or so, I was diagnosed with autism. I got bullied a lot. Everyone saw me as the weird kid and wanted absolutely nothing to do with me. My classmates would make fun of me and exclude me. Starting from kindergarten, I had anxiety. I would say I was sick so I could leave school early on almost a daily basis. I felt that my life had no purpose and that going to college was definitely out of the question for me. Little did I know that one class I signed up for in sixth grade, a class I knew nothing about and signed up for only because my fifth grade teacher recommended it, would make my life take a sharp turn and change my world forever. Because of AVID, I became surrounded by students that had goals and dreams for themselves. In AVID, I've gotten to learn what college life is like. I've researched universities and went on campus tours. My favorite part has been having speakers come in and share with us some of the struggles they went through and what their backgrounds consisted of. There was something that everyone was able to relate to in some shape or form. In particular, there was one speaker that I could relate to. She has Down syndrome, and despite this, she went to UC Berkeley and now has a very successful job at the airport. It was this that lit a fire of motivation within me. Joining AVID was not only the best thing for me, but the best decision I've made. AVID has taught me the value of an education. AVID is what encouraged me to not only get involved in my school, but also in my community. It was AVID that forced me to do the once despised Cornell notes, binder checks, <laughs> grade checks and tutorials that have helped prepare me for college. And it was AVID that has instilled in me the skills and assets that have made me not only a better student, but also a better person. AVID became the guidance and support that I needed by paving my path to success, empowering me, and restoring my self-confidence. AVID has transformed my life in ways I could have never imagined. I'm not just some teen with autism, I'm a key club spirit coordinator, an honor roll student, an AP scholar. A National Honor Society member, a member of my school's varsity golf team, and I'm currently in the top 4% of my class. If you had asked my elementary school self what I wanted to be when I grew up, I would have told you a fashion designer or a famous actress on Broadway or some other career that wouldn't require me to go to college. If, <laughs> if you told my elementary school self that this is what my future looked like, I would have been like, oh, hell no. If you ask me now, I'll tell you that I want to go to Western Washington University. <laughs> UC Santa Cruz or Scripps, <laughs> or Scripps College. <laughs> Study anthropology and art history. <laughs> and become a Scandinavian archeologist. In conclusion, it was AVID that invoked hope and belief into my life, modifying my perspective by evolving how I approach obstacles that life may throw at me. It was AVID that provided me with enriching experiences and opportunities that awakened my ambitious spirit, something that I will carry on with me for the rest of my life as I continue to tear down barriers and make my dreams come true. Thanks to AVID, I can now imagine a life for me where people don't see me as just some person with autism, but rather as an amazing person that accomplished so much with her life, defied all odds, and made her dreams come true. Thank you.